What is good, YouTube? Um, we back at it again. We got another request for uh, Tim. This is not the right songs. This is behind the scenes. Something I just watched. Um, Tim. Pope song. Um, we're looking at the Pope song. Uh, give me a second. If you're new to my channel, if you're not in my channel, run over to Tim's place, please. Uh, show him some love. Like and subscribe. If you like what I do, please like, comment down below. Um, I was told to check out with the orchestra, so that'll be this one. One thing. Um, one second here. Sorry. I think the volume's good. Looks like the the footage is a little a little grainy, but we can work with it. Let's dive in. One thing seems to be a truth, and that is that if a, a, a person or an institution are held sacred by too many people, then they are by definition beyond criticism. And when a person or an institution becomes beyond criticism, it seems they slip inevitably towards corruption. All right, and it's called the Pope Song. I feel like I know where this is going. So if you're if you're given a platform that is sort of silver spooned, or all right. I feel like we're going to get religious real quick and, and offensive to probably a lot of people um, just based on where he started this at. But, um, and knowing Tim's loosely sort of knowing his views on religion, um, he might have some things to say. Um, okay, let's hear it. Fuck the motherfucker, fuck the... Oh. <laughs> There's no way I'm going to be able to post this. Hold on. He, it took him 20 seconds to get there? Jesus. Fuck the motherfucker. Fuck the motherfucker. Fuck the motherfucker. He's a fucking mother. Fuck the motherfucker. Fuck the motherfucker. Fuck the motherfucker. What is True, I can't post this. <laughs> he can. I can't. Oh, I, all right. So he's he's calling out the indiscretions of... And I'm I'm pretty sure there's some 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 Catholics and some he's gonna I would assume piss a lot of people off, but at the same point, like uh All right, we'll we'll see if this gets allowed. Um I did everything with copyright that I could, but <laughs> it's definitely gonna go on Patreon. Um But alright, let's start over because he's he's saying a lot. He's a fucking mother. Fuck the motherfucker. Fuck the motherfucker. Fuck the motherfucker. What is the SSO? Fuck the motherfucker. The SSO. All right. So the Sydney. How did he get this entire orchestra to? And you got to think of. I, besides the fact that they're Australian and they probably know and love Tim, but to to oh, go along with and and they have families and they have religions and. They have their own, you know, thoughts. Um, it, that's that's incredible to convince an entire orchestra. To, I'm sorry, I'm talking a lot, but um, I don't even need to cuss to to get this band. He's doing it for me, so. <laughs> fuck the fuck the motherfucker. Fuck the motherfucker. Fucking fuck the motherfucker. Fuck the motherfucker. Fuck the motherfucking. And, and the fact that the the instrumental behind it is like almost like whimsical and like Disney esque gives a, a listen to it. It gives a weird twist to to what he's talking about. The, the whole narrative. Um, is fucked on purpose. Um, the song sounds like it's made for children. If you take the vocals out of it, obviously what he's saying, um, it, it sounds like, it sounds like a Disney classic. <laughs> Tim. Motherfucker and fuck you, motherfucker, if you think that motherfucker is sacred. 
If you cover for another motherfucker who's a kitty fucker, fuck you, you're no better than the motherfucking rapist. And if you don't like the swearing, this motherfucker falls from me and reckon it shows moral or intellectual falsity, then fuck you, motherfucker. This is language one employs, and one is a little bit cross at motherfuckers, fucking boys. Yep. <laughs> And I don't give a fuck if calling the Pope a motherfucker means you unthinkingly brand me and unthinking apostate. This has now to do with other fucking godly motherfuckers. I'm not interested right now in theological debate. There are other fucking songs and there'll be other fucking ways. I'll be a religious apologist on other fucking days. But the fact remains, if you protect a single kitty fucker, the Pope or Prince or Plumber, you're a fucking motherfucker. Yeah! So, now that I think about it, um, I'm pretty sure YouTube can't ban my song or my reaction to it. Um... Because my direct comment right back to them would be, okay, so then you're saying you're in support of child molestation and rape, right? Oh, no? Okay. Well, you just don't like the F word a lot? Yeah. I mean, have you listened to rap music nowadays? You post that shit, so... <laughs> it's some Alice in Wonderland type shit. It's... <laughs> I just... it. There's some wicked witch dancing around somewhere that's that's loving this the instrumental on this. And from what uh, from what I was told, he wrote, you know, sort of the entire composition instrumentally the, the entire way through, which doesn't surprise me at all. Um, I mean, we got a we got xylophones, we we got everything, we got an entire orchestra. Let's bring the strings together. Let's just. Uh, <laughs> Oh, and I don't give a fuck what any other motherfucker believes about Jesus and his motherfucking mother I've no problem with the spiritual beliefs of other fuckers While those beliefs don't impact on the happiness of others But if you build in church on claims of moral authority And with threats of hell impose it on others in society Then you, you motherfucker, can expect some fucking rap When it turns out you've been fucking us in our motherfucking asses Our motherfucking asses so fuck the motherfucker and fuck you motherfucker If you're still a motherfucking papist If you covered for a single motherfucker Who's a kitty fucker fucking He's as evil as the motherfucking rapist And if you look into your motherfucking heart And tell me true If this motherfucking stupid fucking song Offended you Look at the women on the violins right now Look how straight their faces are Like, that that's literally like Um just because they know they're going to be on video. Um, basically, like, a sort of a scare into, like, I'm just doing my job. I got I got paid to... I play violin. I didn't write the song. That's 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 what these faces are telling me. Uh, Tim's like, I don't give a fuck. Uh, fuck this motherfucker. <laughs> With its filthy fucking language and a fucking disrespect. If it made you feel angry, go ahead and write a letter. But if you find this song more offensive than the possibility... Basically, the, the the underhanded part of that is 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 him saying if if I'm gonna I'm gonna purposefully make pretty much two out of every third word in this entire song fuck. Um, I'm going to point it at the Pope. Um, and if, if you take offense to that, you, you need to question your morals. Um, because you're not, you're either brainwashed, you're not seeing clearly, um, with regards to sort of what happens within that system. So he's just, he's saying that the, the allowance of, um, the ability to use sort of misguided you, the ability to use your merits or for lack of a better term, throw your dick around or your weight around. Um, no pun intended, really. Uh, to, to break laws because you can. Um, and you know that you can probably hide 98% of it, right? Um, he's like, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put together a damn orchestra and I'm just going to say f a big old fuck you. Um, and if people have a problem with that, then they got a problem with other things too. If the Pope 
a fucking disco ball. He made a party out of this. <laughs> the lighting, just look around. I mean, this is not the best footage, but like you get what was happening. Like, it's it's a fucking it's like I said, it's like a Disney party, and it's a I don't know. It's 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 some fucking retro festival that he's throwing. Um, it's it's humor. Um, but it's pointed humor for a reason. Disco, no one come because they won't allow gays there. And, and then obviously his play on words, no one to, no one to come because they don't allow. All right. Um, <laughs> Jesus. No one to come because they won't allow gays there. Who stopped the dancing? Who stopped the dancing? And you hear the horns. It's like now it's now we're now we're in the disco era. You saw the disco ball. Now we're we're throwing parties in in different eras for it's 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 the funniest. It's brilliant. Uh it really is. Like some Saturday Night Live shit, man. You got men at work here, right? Uh, thi this might not see the light of day. Um, <laughs> do me a favor. Uh, please go support Tim, like I said. Um, I'm not even sure this particular one was on his page, but... Um, regardless, go, uh, go, go support, like, and subscribe to Tim, the artist, first and foremost. If you like what I do, please like, comment down below. Um, I will say one thing. I'm just reacting to shit. I didn't write this. I don't need a bunch of religious hit or hit, hate thrown my way. You know, this isn't, um, and no, I'm not being apologetic for that. You get my opinions throughout, um, but I don't need to. I don't need weird comment battles, either either which way. Um, but uh, it's uh, the song was done for a reason. I, th I think he, I think he got his words across correctly. Good good choice of words. He used my favorite word. Like I think I counted 197 times before I stopped counting. Um, I'm just kidding. I wasn't counting, obviously, but. Um, anyways, yeah, have a wonderful rest of your day, your night, wherever time zone you're at. We'll catch you on the next.